Hello everybody and welcome back to another how to get started in Star Citizen video. Today we are looking at Lorville. So in Lorville, uh, which is located on Hurston, we have a uh, we have a room, <laughs> just like any other starting location. Um, you start uh, by waking up in this room. Uh, to go ahead and get up, you want to go ahead and press the Y button. All right, so you have now stood up and uh, just looking around. This is just a, like a like a, like a basic little mini apartment. Um, not very uh, chic, uh, very industrial. Uh, but what we're here today to do today is actually get you over to the starport. So that's the main purpose here. Now I'm moving around just using the regular WASD uh, controls. Now you'll probably be moving a lot faster than this when you first get started like this right here. Um, that's because you can use the scroll wheel on your mouse to control your speed. If you scroll down with your mouse wheel, you can slow down to like a nice saunter. And uh, if you scroll up, you walk at a very brisk pace. If you hold a shift button, just like every other FPS game, you can actually run. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, get out the door, hold F. And you'll notice that this panel lights up because I'm looking at it. And if you left click on it, it opens. Now, once you step outside this room and that door closes, you cannot get back in because these are temporary stay uh, things. I guess you only pay for the time that it takes for you to wake up. All right, so um, if you started down there, you wanna take these stairs up and there's the exit right there. Now, how did I just zoom in? Hold F and scroll wheel up, scroll wheel down, scroll wheel up. See? You'll notice that there are uh, hints coming up at the bottom of the screen. If you wanna turn those off, go ahead and press the escape button, hit options first page that you land on at the fourth option down says show hints hit the arrow now it says no hit escape and now they won't show up anymore let's go over here to this exit this is actually an elevator hold f left click on call elevator wait for it to arrive you'll notice on the bottom left corner there are a couple of icons one represents uh hydration and the other one represents nutrition uh slash you know how hungry you are and um we're going to go ahead and choose ground floor on this elevator. So yeah, um, your hydration and nutrition levels will deplete over time, especially the more running around you do, uh, the heavier your armor is. Um, it basically drains you of energy and hence your hydration levels are the first to go. So um, if you don't pack anything else on your adventures, make sure to pack some water. Uh, um, different drinks are available uh, at different locations. Uh, water being your number one uh, different things hydrate you differently so but again water will hydrate you quickest just like in real life all right so you'll notice uh, if you're just following along that I came from over there we're gonna run up these stairs down this way again we're going to the spaceport we're not really worried about anything else but you'll start to notice that there's signs to get you to the spaceport this is the hospital Maria pure of heart and then here's another sign, perimeter line or spaceport line. We're going to the spaceport, so we're going this way. All right, don't worry about the security. They won't bother you unless you have a crime stat. If, uh, meaning if you're a criminal, then yeah, they'll, they'll, they'll bother you a whole lot. They'll just gun you down without questions asked. In this game, you're always guilty before proven innocent. Sometimes also like in real life. All right, so we are here on the tram for Lorville. This takes us directly to the spaceport. It's kind of hard to get lost because, you know, there's only so many places you can go, at least for now in the game. All right, so here we can look outside. Unfortunately, because it is nighttime, you can't really see all that much because of all the glare on these windows, you know, because uh, anti-glare is a lost technology, apparently. That's the, that, that big building right there that overshadows all the others. That is the main Hurston building. That's where the Hurston family um, or the descendants live and they oversee everyone. This is a very dystopian city. It's very dirty. It's all about just cheap labor and yeah, it's not a good time to be here. So, all right, so we are uh, pulling up right now and 
Look at that, a one-to-one -one copy of the exact same platform that we just left, but now it's the spaceport. So now we're gonna go ahead and head to the exit. When you come out here, do not turn a right unless you wanna to go to that big building, which is another tram that takes you there, but go left, which takes you to the spaceport. This is the quote unquote customs area. Like, don't worry about this area. They're not gonna they're not gonna bother you. You can just walk right through. That's not in the game yet, you know, uh, uh, the whole customs and declaring items and stuff, it's not a big deal. It doesn't matter if you carry guns or not. They don't care. All right, so here, this bank of screens is how you call your ship. Go ahead and walk up to one of them, hold F, left click. And now you have an entire list of ships. Now, um, if you are just starting in this game, which is probably why you're watching this video, you're only going to have one ship, and that and that's and that's going to be, you know, on the list instead of everything else, like you see here. So um, I have my Drake Cutter, which is also one of the starter ships. I'm going to go ahead and hit Retrieve, and then it's going to tell you where they located it or where they stored it. There we go. Hangar 9. So to get to your hangar, we're just going to keep on walking. So you notice how it's kind of like it, it was almost linear. So we're just going to walk this way. Now we can go either to this bank of elevators or this bank of elevators. It does not matter. Going to go ahead and call elevator. Remember, hold F and click. And then it's and there's even an icon here that shows you where your ship is. Hangar nine. That that hangar uh, word that used to not be there. That, um, just a few patches ago, that was added. That that's a very nice addition. Be very glad that that's there. That prevents you from having to run all the way back to the terminal screen and find out where your ship is. But yeah, now we'll notice that you don't see hangar nine on this list. But that's because you have to scroll down. Hold F and scroll wheel downwards, and boom, there it is. Click on hangar nine, and see now it says next floor hangar nine. Moving, moving, moving. We are going and we are here. Welcome to the hangar. This is your ship. All right. So now that you know how to get to your ship, um, I will be having other videos on how to actually take off from locations. So if you want to watch that, uh, go ahead and uh, click the video on the screen right now. I do hope you enjoy this video. You all have a good one and stay safe out there.